Um, my name is Cindy Petreski. I'm the director of the Aging and Disability Resource Center of Portage County. I have been with the county for seven and a half, eight, a half years, roughly. Um, the ADRC is considered to be a fully integrated aging unit and aging and disability resource center. So we serve both Older Americans Act programming that comes from the federal level that funneled down through the state as well as the Aging and Disability Resource Center population. Much of what we do, but not all of it, is reflected in federal and state statutes and or, um, rules. Um, we have six divisions within the ADRC. The first is caregiver support services. In 2015, we served 608 people who were caregivers at the ADRC. Um, we had more than, um, I'm sorry. <laughs> my son's getting married this weekend, so my, my stress levels are like right here right now. Um, <laughs> We launched the Dementia Friendly um, Community Initiative last year for caregiver support services. We also have the Community Resources um, Division within the ADRC. Last year we served over 3,000 people with, at the Community Resources, which includes long-term care enrollments, information and assistance, disability benefit specialists, elder benefit specialists, and the loan closet. Our benefit specialists brought in more than $7 million into Portage County last year, um, helping people access their, their benefits. Of the people that we worked with, less than 4% actually enrolled into publicly funded long-term care. So much of what we do is about helping people stay in the community, in their own homes, using their own resources. Our nutri nutrition program has six sites. Lincoln Center, High Rise in the city of Stevens Point, Plover, which serves Tuesdays and Thursdays. Um, Rocheltz serves five days a week at Faith Lutheran Church. Jensen's, um, Jensen Center in Amherst serves Monday, Wednesday, and Fridays. And Junction City serves Tuesdays and Thursdays. We served over 52,000 meals to 1,400 people in Portage County last year. We have a senior center, which had over um, 1,900 participants last year. We have more than 167 classes. We also include evidence-based health classes and the Holly Shop as part of our senior center. So lots of programs going on for seniors at the ADRC. Our transportation program provided more than 18,000 trips last year. It's 18,686 in 2015. Okay. And we have an RSVP program.